welcome back. We're here at Ambler Custom Guitars and in my hand at the minute, this is the Juliet model. Um, now obviously all these guitars are gorgeous and they're all my favourite models, but this is my absolute favourite. Saying that I really like this one as well, the Hound Dog just above me. Um, but this one, I do love this one. So we've got a Zirakoti top on here, a Honduran mahogany body and this gorgeous flame maple neck on here, if we get close upon that. Goto locking tuners, brass nut, and then the Duesenberg trim at this end, and of course the gold foil pickups. So let's give it a lesson. Welcome back, we're at Ambler Custom Guitars, and we're with John in the workshop now. Um, John's working on three new models at the minute, which he's been kind enough to let us track from start to finish. So, John, what are you working on? Yeah, so first up, we are going to make a one of my Icarus models, which is based off the original Gibson Firebird. I've uh, redesigned it slightly from the original Gibson, like taking the waist in a bit, uh, worked on balance issues that the original Gibson's had. Uh, so we're going to make a new one of those. This time I've got the Icarus model. Um, so we've got this bolted eucalyptus top on this one. We've got black limber body and neck and then back over again we've got black palm fingerboard brass nut uh, McNally P90s and the Stagger Swagger pickups and then we've got sets bar to finish it off so let's get this one plugged in Hellraiser base models, which is it's my own design. It's aimed at the kind of heavy rock and metal base scene. And this is the third. That's the third, third one I will have ever made. Yes, uh, the original prototype was made for my little brother, who's a keen bass player. The second one went down to a collector down in London, and so I'm really excited to get going with the third. Welcome back. We're at Ambler Custom Guitars, and in my hands here I've got the Hound Dog model. I've just said that the Juliet is my favourite model. But I've just played this one again, and this is my favourite model now, um, and I think that will change throughout the day as I play each one. So we've got the Honduran mahogany body on this one, we've got maple neck, then we've got flame maple fingerboard, and pickups wise we've got the McNally Autumn pickups which sound awesome. And then my favourite part of this guitar is a scratch plate because that looks gorgeous, have a look at that. So let's give this one a lesson. And now the last one, the one I'm really excited about. Um, talk us through this one. Yes, yeah, so this is going to be the very first Telecaster style guitar that's ever been made in the Ambler Customs Workshop. Made a few tweaks to the design, but uh, most of it we're going to keep under wraps until we've, we see the finished instrument. Welcome back, we're at Ambler Custom Guitars, and this time I've got the Solomon model, and this is John's latest model, and it's gorgeous. There's not much more to say on this one. This is a stunning guitar. We've got a Spalted flame redwood top on this one, and then turning it over, we've got a nine piece ash body. Then we've got a roasted flame maple neck. You'll have to forgive me because there's so many cool features, I've had to write them down so I don't forget them all. So we've got the roasted flame maple neck, um, and then back over here, we've got the Floyd Rose FRX bridge, Seymour Duncan Duality pickups, and then we've got a Zero Coty fingerboard on this one. So let's give this a listen. <laughs> 